Let's pray. Thank you, Lord, that we can uh, come together this morning, that we can learn and uh, sing to you. We thank you for song, Lord, and pray that you will bless today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, last week we learned about Timothy. Joe. Joe. We learned about why God lets us suffer. He lets us suffer to make us better, doesn't he? It makes us better, even though we don't always know at the same time it happens. Let's read it together. You ready? Job chapter 23, verse 10. But he knoweth the way that I take. When he hath tried me, I shall come forth as gold. Gold. Gold's very valuable. You know that? When you get tried, you become more valuable, don't you? Like more purified, like gold. Okay, but today we're talking about singing. Singing to God. Who knows what the biggest book in the Bible is? Biggest book in the Bible. Do you know, Simon? Psalms. Psalms. And what is the book of Psalms about? What is it? Anyone here? Starts with this. Starts with this letter. Singing. It's about songs, isn't it? Look at Who likes singing? Who likes singing? You guys like singing? Who has a favorite song? Does anyone have a favorite song? Who has a favorite song? You have a favorite song? What's it? Your favorite song? What is it? <laughs> Do you have a favorite song? Huh? Is it gonna burn? How does it go? Can you sing it? <laughs> You're just too shy to sing it, aren't you? Singing. Hey, God likes singing. Who thinks they can sing well? You think you can sing well? Who thinks they don't sing well? Who thinks they don't sing well? <laughs> hey, you know, whether or not you sing well or you don't sing well, you know, God likes hearing you singing. You know? Have you ever had somebody sing you a song before? What about when, you, when you, it's your birthday and everyone sings for you? Happy birthday to you. Uh, you like that, don't you? Hey, well, God's the same. God likes it when we sing to God. You know, you like it when people sing for you? God likes it too. God likes to be sung to you. That's why we like, we sing. We sing to God. Okay, what's our memory verse for today? It's from Psalm 100, verse 2. Serve the Lord with gladness. Who knows what gladness means? Simon. That's it, happy. All right, so you don't serve the Lord. It's like, ah, oh, I've got to serve the Lord. No, you've got to serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with Sarah. Singing. All right, let's read it together. Ready? Psalm chapter 100, verse 2. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. See, he wants us to serve him happily and sing to him. So God likes it when we sing to him. Can you put your hand down, Simon? Okay, what are some places where we can sing to God? What do you think this is, Sarah? Yeah, in church. Right, so same in kids' club. Hey, boys. And in church. Eyes up here, guys. Eyes up here. Don't be distracted. So some places we can sing to God. One place is at church. But is church the only place you can sing to God? No. So what's another place you can sing to God? Let's talk about some, and then we'll see if you have some ideas. Church. Hello? So it's not only church. What about here? What is this, Simon? In a opera house? Yeah, like in a choir. So you can sing to God like a choir. Right? So you have men and women here. They're all dressed nicely. But is church and choir the only place you can sing to God? No. How else can you sing to God? <laughs> what, about, what about here? Where's this? In the shower. You're right. See, some people think, I can only sing to God. No, you can sing to God even when you're having a shower, can't you? God likes it when you sing to him. Like this guy singing in the shower. Where else? Timothy, in the car, sometimes when you're driving somewhere, 
You know, you can sing to God as well in the car. See, so we can sing to God anywhere, can't we? It's another place you can sing. Simon? In the park. In the park. Maybe when you're just going for a walk outside and enjoying the nice creation of God. Well, it's not a perfect creation now, but it was. You can sing to God and praise Him as you're walking along. What other ways can you praise God? Where are, what other places? You can think of some. What's another place? Though? At home. Yeah, I think I've got that one too. Oh, no, I don't. I thought I had that one. <laughs> home. Who's got another one? You got an idea? Did you have one? In your room. Very good. Yeah, even in your bedroom. All right, you can sing to God. What's another one? Traveling in a plane. That's very good too. Sometimes when you're in a plane, you might sing to God. <coughs> Who else has got some ideas? Anyone here? You guys still awake? Still awake? You with me? Yeah? <laughs> What's another one? Last one. If you've got a job of mining, you can sing Ah, very good. That's right. If you're mining as well, if you're in the caves, you could be singing there. Imagine the echoes going through the caves. So, you see, you can sing... Anywhere to God it doesn't just have to be at church with all the believers. You might sing in a choir. Some people sing when they're having a bath, shower in the car. And you guys had some good ideas too at home, in your room, on the plane, and even when you're mining. When you're mining, you can sing to God. So God likes <coughs> singing. Okay, so we can sing to God anywhere, and it's good to sing to God, isn't it? That's what we're learning today. God likes it when we sing. All right, let's read our memory verse again. You ready? Psalm chapter 100 verse 2. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Okay, all right, we've got an activity today that Philip has organized.